So this photo is clearly quite dark. Now I can go into the photo tool and bring up the levels dialog, which shows me a histogram of the brightness levels here, and you can see it's all dark, not surprisingly, from the photo. And before you can adjust these brightness start and end points, but now we can just click on the curve and create manual brightness curves. So it's all done on the same dialogue, but the ability to manually edit the curve is new. And so, for example, on this one, what I can do is just brighten the dark bits. And in fact, if I just pick that bit up there... What I'm doing now is just affecting the dark parts of the photo, and the bright parts are not affected at all. So in the curve, everything is the same up there, but down here I've got a custom brightness curve. So that's a much more powerful way, it's more advanced, but you can actually create some extreme effects with this, and I can go and really mess around with the brightness curves. In fact, I can go and invert it completely. So wherever I click, I can add a new point in. So I can make my curve as complex as I like to create crazy effects. If I right-click, we delete these points, but that's inverted, so in effect that curve goes backwards, so you've got a complete negative. In fact, were I to scan a negative on a slide scanner and scan a negative in and do that, that would turn that into a positive. So that's the curves tools.